Unless someone brings me Ladybug and Cat. The big question on everyone's lips, how did Monarch manage to get his hands on the Miraculous Ladybug was supposed to protect? I thought the holder of the Dog Miraculous was Adrian Agrest. You know who I'm talking about? Um, vaguely, yes. Well, it turns out, Formidable wasn't Adrian Agrest, but I didn't know that, and I mistakenly gave the Miraculous to his cousin, Felix. He looks so much like him, he passed himself off as Adrian. So that's how he stole the Miraculous from you. Yes, and now Monarch has them. In that case, they both made a mistake, because that proves the two of them are linked somehow. We have to hunt down Felix. Let's switch to hyperspeed. Ladybug, you were supposed to protect the Miraculous. You have failed in your duty as Guardian. Dark Wings fall! I swore I'd have you all under my control. Granted, two of your friends managed to get away from my dear nephew Felix. And the Miraculous of the Rabbit did get away from me. But don't be fooled. Now that your powers are mine, Ladybug and Cat Noir's Kwame's will soon join you. But I did protect the Miraculous. Then explain how they're no longer in your possession. The 15 that remain in the box, including the rabbit. What would happen if Monarch decided to use that Miraculous to change the course of time? She already tried. I... But don't worry. We got it back and put it somewhere safe. We trusted it to an exceptional holder. And we're going to do the same for all the others. Mm, because we finally have a clue that might lead us to Monarch. So instead of blaming us, help us, Grandmaster, and trust us for once. You're right, Ladybug. I should have helped you. Instead, I let myself be distracted by the modern world, like these incredibly expensive shoes and these electronic gadgets that wasted away four months of my existence with videos of cute kittens. <sighs> I've been a guardian for longer than you have. I am more experienced and stronger. Instead of being a piercing spear, I should have been a protective shield. Uh, fine, fine, but please get up. You know, everybody makes mistakes, so uh, just try to find something you could do to help us. That'd be great. You are right. I, uh, I'll go back to the temple uh. to get some backup. <sighs> uh. He's not going to leap all the way to Tibet like that, is he? American billionaire Colt Fathom, who died last year, and aristocrat Lady Amelie Graham de Vanilli, a triple kung fu and horse riding medalist, chess prodigy, and England's youngest graduate, lives in London with his mother, the twin sister to the wife of famous fashion designer Gabriel Agrest. My son wasn't here this morning when I woke up. I didn't worry, though, because I thought he might have gone to see his cousin Adrian in Paris. Those two are so fond of each other. But Felix wasn't returning my calls, though I contacted his uncle Gabriel. He told me he hadn't seen him. And yet he was in Paris. I talked to him. Oh, Cosmo Bug, Astro Cat, I hope nothing's happened to him. Don't worry, ma'am. He'll probably end up at his uncle's. Or he might already be on his way back home to London. Thanks so much to the two of you for your support. What if we're wrong about Felix? Do you think he might be one of Monarch's victims instead? I just don't know. He was our only lead to recover the Miraculous. We'll find more leads, Monarch will keep attacking, and we'll figure out what happened to Felix. Until we do, we're gonna have to be more careful than ever. With all the powers that Monarch has now, we have to expect anything at any time. I know. Let's head back. It's been a long day. <laughs> <laughs> 